Hey, welcome to yet another fantastic episode of Five Lakes Garage. Today we're going to go over the one month in of the OV Tune. Okay, I'm riding in my 2019 Toyota Tacoma uh, off-road package. Uh, it does have the OV Tune put on it. Uh, there's another video on how all that worked, uh, pain in the butt, but it did go through and so far I've been ecstatic with the whole setup. Um, it, it made me decide to keep the truck. Uh, if the tune wasn't going to work, uh, I may have tried, I might try one other option, which I think th is through uh, Gail Banks through the Pedal Monster. Um, but the OV tune seems to be doing all, checking all the boxes that I needed. Uh, except for a couple which I'll go over that here in a second but first let's go with the not so good things okay um, I think they need to do a little bit more work on the progressive ramping of the maps if you are at if you're trying to rev through the revs it will start jumping like it goes completely different maps different power rating and it's kind of it just keeps ramping up so trying to keep something smooth has been very difficult. Um, it's not quite impossible, but it is difficult. You have to try to rev, you know, match your foot to where you anticipate the jumps will be. Um, it's not a huge thing. I can get around it. A um, couple of the good, uh, not so good things is the, uh, wow, really? I think that's it. It's just the revs. Um, I do have it on the highest setting right now and I do have to put 93 octane in there which is totally fine I'm kind of used to it from my BMW but yeah that's the only downside I see about it and I'm sure that they are still working on it and that they will try to correct this particular issue so I'm sure I'm not the only one having it so on to the good things which my good list is a whole lot longer than my bad list, which isn't usually that common, <laughs> really. But anyway, uh, good things. I've gotten so much better fuel mileage. Uh, at least two to almost two and a half more miles per gallon than I did before. It, um, I don't have to shift gears. Um, I do have a, five, a six speed manual and going up a hill, I don't have to shift. If I come up to a, a yield sign, I slow down. I don't have to go to first, just go to second, you're fine. You have um, so much more bottom end torque, so much bottom end power. Now, I don't really think, it may have gained a few extra horsepower throughout the revs, but that wasn't really the goal. The goal was to make the power that you have usable. Um, just to speed up, I should not have to tack it out to you know 5,000 RPM every single time. So I will give OV Tune Orange Virus a lot of credit. Thank you very much. Appreciate all that. And hopefully you'll be able to fix some of the, the jumpiness. Uh, some of the other good things, uh, I did tow with it. Um, that same boat that I talked about in my rant. And I towed it again. And this time I went a little bit further and it was fantastic um, i still feel that it was back there I mean, it's a really old boat but it just went through and towed fantastically um, no complaints on that one i'm getting ready to put a brake controller on this so that uh, i do have a utility trailer right now it is full of wood um, i do sell wood so i need to go out there and i can take my dodge but the air condition doesn't work and it's really hot in North Carolina right now and I really want air conditioning so um, I don't have I don't see that the uh, Tacoma will have a problem pulling it my only problem would be stopping it now the trailer does have trailer brakes on it but I don't have a brake controller here in the taco so I'm doing some research right now I got a couple candidates I want to look at I did see that they had some issues with um, uh, people have frying up the entire electrical system on their truck um, so I definitely want to take a look at that and make sure that uh, we're going to be good to go. But anyway, I'm ranting. OV Tune, I'll still give, give it the thumbs up. 
uh, yes, it was expensive, but it does make the truck livable. Um, I'm ready to put on tires. I'm ready to put on a lift. Uh, I'm actually waiting for um, Marlin Crawler, Marlin Crawler, to put out their new lift. Uh, right now, it's I'm still in prototype phase. They say about mid-September they'll put it out. We'll take a look at that one and look at the price. I got to sell some more wood. I need more part. I need to pay for these parts. So anyway. Stay tuned to the channel. Uh, I'll try to go over some more stuff uh, in progress with the Tacoma. Also got some Jeep builds that we're looking at. But like, subscribe, keep uh, hit that bell so you'll know when I'm actually putting it out. And enjoy your Tacoma. Peace.